the cast of Friends coming together again to grieve the sudden loss of their beloved Matthew Perry and issue a joint statement. We were more than just castmates. We are a family. Jennifer Aniston, Courtney Cox, Lisa Kudrow, Matt LeBlanc, and David Schwimmer writing, There is so much to say, but right now we're going to take a moment to grieve and process this unfathomable loss. The 54-year-old actor was found unresponsive in a hot tub Saturday afternoon at his Pacific Palisades home. Sources familiar telling NBC News that Perry's assistant had left to run an errand and returned to find Perry unresponsive and called 911. The Los Angeles Fire Department said that firefighters removed Perry from the hot tub, but that he was already dead when they arrived. I'm not great at the advice. Can I interest you in a sarcastic comment? While he will always be remembered for his signature role as Chandler Bing on Friends. Someone at work ate my sandwich. <laughs> Well, what did the police say? Perry also starred in movies like The Whole Nine Yards, 17 Again, and Fools Rush In, which he once called his best film work. His co-star Salma Hayek posting, I will continue to cherish your silliness, your perseverance, and your lovely heart. Behind that trademark wit and charming smile, there was darkness. In his 2022 memoir, Perry opened up about his decades-long battle with drugs and alcohol. But more recently, the sport of pickleball had become an outlet during his recovery journey, according to his friend and former coach. And he brought people to the court that had struggles, um, similar struggles to his own. Just hours before his death, the star had been playing with mutual friends at a nearby country club. Brokenhearted fans have been laying flowers outside his L.A. home. In last night, pop singer Charlie Puth leading his audience in an emotional version of the Friends theme song. Although there have been no reports indicating foul play, the cause of death is being investigated by the LAPD and the L.A. County Medical Examiner's Office. And officials say that they now want to await those toxicology results, which could take about three to four months. So it's mm. going to be a little bit of time before we know exactly what has happened. Yeah. Yeah. All right, Chloe. Thank you so thank much. You, Chloe. Chloe. Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.